Hey, this is Rich over at TVP Live with another quick tips brought to you by Adobe Photoshop Elements Tutorials Group. And let's jump right in. Today's poster had this logo, wants to be able to share it with their family and friends. But the only um, caveat is that she wanted to make the logo on its own without a background. And right now it sits with a white background. It's pretty simple to do. What we want to do is change this into a PNG. But if you just go to File, Save As, and then choose down this a PNG. What happens is you're going to save it as a PNG, including the background. You can see the background. If I open it up, it turns into a photo here with the background. So what we want to do is save it without the background. So I'm going to unlock the picture first, and then I'm going to go to grab the magic tool. And since this is nice, sharp, edges we can send uh, tolerance to I don't know 50 percent and then you just click here in the white that'll select everything in the white because it's a solid color and you hit delete and now that deletes the background I'm going to deselect by uh, calling control D out down and then uh, crop it a little bit closer to the edges of the actual photo so I'm going to go like this with the cropping tool and I'm going to hit OK. Now we cropped the photo down to just the logo without any backgrounds. Now I can go to File, Save As, come down here and choose PNG and then I'll just call it logo uh, dash PNG and I'll hit Save and then I'll hit OK. And you'll see right here the logo was saved just as a PNG without the background. How do we know it doesn't have a background? I'm going to open it up and see what it looks like. And there's the logo without the background. And that's all there is to it. That's all there is for this tutorial. This is Rich calling it quits saying over and out.